Well, by doing this, I want to show you that you all can contribute to this kind of thing and help. Like, you all have good ideas. I don't care how, how young you are or whatever. It's just as valid as what we're doing up here. So keep drawing, keep coming up with ideas. But broccoli's kind of, it kind of looks like a tree, right? So it's kind of, it's kind of bushy, maybe, on top. Well, what, he's a bad guy, right? Is he angry? Do you guys think he's angry? What's he angry about? But nobody likes him. Maybe he's got like self-confidence issues, so he's he's defensive because people get mad at him and nobody, people get grossed out by him because he's a little stinky. So maybe we should we should remember that stinky thing, right? I'm gonna write stinky up here because broccoli stinks, right? We're gonna get back to stinky in a second, but you know we're gonna, we're gonna keep thinking while we're while we're drawing the bushiness. But he's angry, so maybe we should give him some some angry, angry eyebrows and angry eyes. Like, there's very basic shapes you can do for, for angry. I mean, everybody knows, like, <coughs> like two circles and two dots. Like, you pretty much have a couple eyes, right? Pretty quick. I mean, they're, not, they're messy, they're sketchy, but but if you want to make him like angry, you can give him eyebrows really quick, right? If you want to make him like angry that and he hasn't slept for days, <laughs> right? Like I'm really angry and I'm tired, like, that kind of thing. So there's things you can like. Just all I did was draw a couple little lines. You guys can all draw little scribble lines, right? That's basically what those are. They just happen to fall in the right place. So I'm gonna I'm gonna like go back over what I was what I was penciling earlier. Kind of bushiness. Look in the mirror too, you know, and look at your eyes and see what your eyebrows do when you're angry. Like make an angry face. Yeah, I do that all the time when I'm drawing. Like, like I'm surprised. Or, you know, I'll, I'll be doing faces and my wife will walk in and my coworkers will walk in and be like, what are you? Are you crazy? Do you like broccoli or something? So I'm drawing this broccoli guy all, all kind of bushy. It almost looks like a big explosion, right? That kind of tells something about his character. I mean, he's kind of, he's kind of hot-headed, kind of crazy, rough and mean. So, you know, I just compared broccoli to an explosion. That's kind of crazy, right? But that's the kind of thing I think about when I'm drawing because it kind of gives you an idea about his character. He's, he's got to get loud. He's got to get crazy. He's ah, he's a bad guy. So he does those things. But I'm going to give him his angry eyes too. He's, he's, Really upset. He's so upset that his eyes are all dilated. <laughs> dilated is a big word, but and he hasn't slept for days because nobody likes him. Right now, since he's a bad guy, do you think he'd stand up all kind of proud, or do you think he'd be kind of hunched over? I heard a hunched over. She's participating. You guys can all shout it out. Yeah. Hunched over. So I'm going to go hunched over with him, right? And you think he's, I mean, he's broccoli. You think he has like big, strong, muscly arms? Or you think he's got like little spindly witch arms? They're kind of creepy. Like, you're thinking strong arms? He's, he's got some meat to him? All right, he might. So we'll give him some, some big, strong arms. And you think his, his hands are like big and medium strong, like the Hulk too, or are they more like, ah, like creepy, like an old tree or something? Creepy? Wow, big strong arms. I'm gonna give him veins and big strong arms. He's so strong. His muscles are full of veins. Veiny broccoli. That's disgusting. Right? You people are disgusting. 